anticipating that the FGI 2018 will be implemented next summer of 2020. And some of the things that we're doing is we're brushing up on the differences between what the current hospital licensing regulations ask for and what the FGI is going to require. There's going to be some cost savings. They are starting to look at other areas that can reduce square footage. For example, the size of an endoscopy room has shrunk a little bit. So Texas wants it at 250 square feet, and the FGI is going to say it's going to be 180, which should provide a cost benefit to the owner. Saving on square footage is the ultimate way to save money. Another benefit is they're going to allow you to combine your pre and post op pack you. That way there could be more flexibility. So you can then flex the beds to accommodate your patient throughput. The Texas rules are based on the FGI. And so it shouldn't be difficult to go ahead and move forward with the new code.